Hi, my name is Alike, and on social media, I also go by Lovely the Vagabond, and that would be Instagram. On Twitter, it's D instead of the, you know, like Lovely the Vagabond. Get it? Okay, not really, maybe. I, uh, let's see, what am I trying to say? I'm new to ish, I shouldn't even say that. I'm trying to get my channel together on YouTube. Until I get it together, I have a range of content that I like to cover that includes fashion, fitness, food, intimate apparel, trends. I think that covers, oh, and being a 40 year old mom. So, uh, with that being said, I don't have a schedule yet of like posting content. I'm trying to get all of that figured out. So until then, please forgive me. Please be patient. Eventually there'll be some continuity with posting schedules and topics and they'll align together. Right now I'm just kind of all over the place. Uh, yes, so that's the topics and categories and things you can find on my channel. And just in general, I've posted a little bit about me before, but my background is in fashion and the entertainment industry. And fast forward to me now being, and that's like career, like money making, what I did work-wise. And now I am a stay-at-home mom, trying to have side hustles, and I'm 40, and I have a baby for the first time. So that kind of encapsulates me at the moment and the reason I'm doing this quick post hopefully I'm gonna make it as quick as possible is that recently I went to I'm in the Chicago area and I went to a really cute event over the weekend and sorry if you can hear my baby crying he's in the bedroom with my dad with my dad with his dad and I went to a really cute event that I found out, out, found out about on Instagram through a company called Prenata Smoothies. And it was in celebration of Black Breastfeeding Week. He is having a moment, my goodness. He's not hungry. He's changed. He's fine. I'm like, he, ugh, it's his bewitching hour. So let me hurry up. Anyway, um, the event was really nice. And it was put together. I thought it was through her, but it was actually put the owner of Prenatal Smoothies. Uh, her name is Chris. I will link her information and kind of everything I talk about below in uh, the comments or whatever as well. But the whole event was put together by um, an organization in Chicago called The Collective. Oh, gosh, I had this information out and then I got sidetracked and what have you. Sorry, I'm looking down to see if I can pull up the information again. It is by the Chicago Birth Works Collective. They put it together and they did a fantastic job. So the, I talked about it was in celebration of Black Breastfeeding Week. I don't know if people know, and this post or video is just a kind of sharing. So I'm going to do that too. Like if I have information and tidbits I can share with you, promote businesses, just give you good information. That's something else I want to do on this channel. But back to the Chicago Birthworks Collective. They, oh no, <laughs> why this matters is that during my pregnancy, I wasn't aware, but I found out that black women and African American women, which is the same thing, uh, suffer disproportionately from, uh, um, what am I trying to say, mortality rates, high mortality rates during delivery and pregnancy, and then the infant mortality and newborn fertility rates are really high, disproportionately for us as well. So make sure that if you're a pregnant, black pregnant woman, um, that you have a loved one, the support of someone that you can always bring to the hospital with you because I think having an advocate there will help in this process. I don't know why. I mean, we just don't receive the kind of care that other ethnic groups receive in general. So if you have the support of someone else there to kind of be your voice, I think that's going to help a, a, a smidgen of a bit. Just 
any, 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 what am I trying to say? Anything can help at the moment, but I think that's a place to start. And if you are able to afford hiring a doula, that would even probably really increase your chances of having better care and yeah, better care at the hospital and during your process of pregnancy. So that being said, the baby's happy. He is not happy right now. With that being said, the event was really nice. They had, it was at a park in Chicago. It, it was a great turnout. They had a photographer there. They had uh, vendors there. Prenatal Smoothies was one of the vendors. And her company, the woman that ran that, her name is Chris. And she, basically the prenatal smoothies are prenatal vitamins and supplements that would come that usually in a form of a pill or a capsule. She puts and makes it into a smoothie and sends them to you. She has two to three flavors right now. They were really good, delicious. I tasted some, one and then bought another flavor. And she was one of the vendors. There's jewelry vendors there as well. There's free food. There were giveaways. There were little play areas for the kids. Uh, moms could breastfeed, and there were men there too, dads, husbands, or whatever, that were supporting the cause. No funny business going on. People were just very loving and caring. And let me tell you, you can't eat everybody's chicken, but the barbecue chicken was really good. <laughs> Uh, the potato salad was good, but they just have really good, great things in general. In addition to what they had, they gave, oh my goodness, one of the most important things I left it in. I already took it out and put it to use. They had one of the covers for your, um, for your car seat for the baby to keep the baby shaded or protect them from the sun or elements. And then you can also use it as a breastfeeding cover. They had that in the little, they had a little, um, like, give away, not giveaway, but, um, like, free merchandise swag bag that they gave to everyone that came, and that was in attendance. So that was the main gift, I don't, and I don't even have that to show. Oh, sorry. But in that bag, they also had things like this. So there's upcoming events that they have around the Chicago area, which I plan on finding out. Uh, more about, but things like uh, a postpartum circle, mindful mama meditation, pregnancy and birth education series, a birth story circle, and that is all through the Chicago Birthworks Collective. So there's organizations out there that do offer support if you're pregnant, and not just in the Chicago area, but, you know, Google these things, look it up. There is there is information and resources out there for us, but we need to utilize those things. Then there's another uh, place called Hello Baby on the south side of Chicago in the, I forgot what area that it was called but I looked it up and I'm gonna see if I can go but it's a free basically place that you can go for playtime with the baby and that is basically how babies learn is you know going to not necessarily going to these places but it, through playtime and interaction but it's really good if you can interact have them interact with other children as well so I will be going to that or looking more into that then there's also a company that is called Imperfect Produce, and basically you can get 50% off. It's Imperfect Produce delivered, and you can save money and eat healthy is basically what they're about, their mission or vision, mission statement, and there's a coupon co code for that. There was, oh, we did Zumba there with so mommy and baby Zumba. So while I was holding my baby, I was getting my Zumba on. They had great music. That was fun and sweet and a really great time. More information on uh, doulas, what they do, who they are, how they can help in the birthing process. And then there's also Mrs. Patel's Milk Water Tea, which I'm um, interested in checking out. And this is like a substantial pack. It's supposed to be one serving of tea, which seems really big, and it's chai spice lactation tea. And since I'm a breastfeeding mama, I will be using it. Anyway, that is what I have to share 
with you about what I did over the weekend, resources for you breastfeeding moms, for black moms. Again, I'll link everything below that I can share. Hopefully, I don't know if I can do the coupon codes. Hopefully I can and I won't get in trouble, but um, enjoy. Thanks for tuning in and I will see you soon. I think I will be posting next on some fashion tidbits. So stay tuned.